I'm Nancy Smith from Paint and Vine TV. Tonight, today's lesson is concerning the script liner. The, the script liner has long bristles, and to use this brush, we need to have inky paint. To create inky paint, you, you first begin with a puddle of paint on your palette, dip into water. I have um, a little bit of water on my brush here, and I, on the side of the puddle of paint, I'm going to just swish it around. Now I'm going to go back to my brush basin which has clear water, get another drop of paint and uh, swish right here in the same area. And I'm going to do that one more time. It's always good practice to dip into your water at least three times to see if it gets inky enough for you. Now how I determine if my paint is thin enough is I just take my brush and gently swish some of this uh, water, watery paint. If I can see my palette underneath that, then I know my paint's thin enough. Now to load this brush, I'm going to lay it flat into the inky portion of the paint that I've just made, lay it down flat, and stroke through. But as I'm pulling it through this paint, I'm twirling it in my fingers. That does two things. It loads the brush as well as gives me a nice point. To paint with the script liner, you want your brush to be perpendicular to the paper. You want just the bristles to be touching the paper. And you need to use your little finger as a, a to steady you or to guide you. Now what I do is, I watch my little finger in the directions that I want it to twirl. And as I'm doing that, my brush is following the direction of my finger. Can you see that? Can you see how my, my little finger is moving and the bristles are following? Let me get some more paint. I'll come back up here again. So I, I'm guiding my strokes using my baby finger, holding my brush straight, perpendicular to the paper. I'm making vi nice and smooth curls. Now if I were not to do that and try to do it without using my fingers, do you see how thick the curly cues are? And there, there's times when it's not smooth. So you just it's very easy if you just hold your brush still and use your little finger. Thank you very much and see you next time.